Let's calculate hypercharge using average charge of the members of its family. Formula for hypercharge is equal to twice of average charge. For example, lambda hyperon. It exists in singlet state with charge 0. So, hypercharge will be 0 for it. Next, we have omega hyperon with average charge minus 1. So, hypercharge will be minus 2 for it. For eta meson, average charge is 0. So, hypercharge will be 0 for it. For nucleons, proton is having charge 1, neutron is having charge 0. So, average charge will be 1 by 2. And hypercharge will be equal to 2 into 1 by 2, 1. So, for proton and neutron, hypercharge is 1. For kion doublet K positive K neutral, average charge is plus 1 by 2. So, hypercharge for them will be plus 1. Similarly, for kion doublet K negative and K anti neutral, hypercharge is minus 1. And for cascade hyperon, hypercharge is going to be minus 1 for each of them. For triplet families like pions and sigma hyperon, every charge is going to be 0. So, hypercharge is 0 for each of them. For delta baryons, every charge will be 2 plus 1 plus 0 minus 1 by 4, which is 1 by 2. So, hypercharge will be 1 for each 